What's up guys, I'm Black Ops Amazing and welcome to another Black Ops 2 Zombies video. So in this video I'm going to be talking about DLC 4. On Call of Duty Black Ops 2 I'm going to be talking about the possible Zombies Easter Egg and what it could contain. And what is going to be happening with the old characters returning and the new characters dying. So I hope you enjoy this video guys. If you do make sure you smack the like button in the face. If we could smash 150 likes on this video that would be absolutely amazing. Hit the subscribe button on screen now for more videos from me and enjoy. Starting out with the East Dragon DLC 4, I don't think we're going to have to link up another pile and like we have been doing on all of the previous Zombies maps in Transit, Buried and Die Rise, we've had to link up pylons all together. The Transit one to Die Rise, Die Rise to Buried and Buried back down to Transit so it makes a little circuit. And we've also had to build the uh, nav card tables and the Transit nav card table, I think this is how it went, but the Transit nav card went into Die Rise, the Die Rise nav card went into Buried and the Buried nav card went into Transit. So again, it made a full circuit. So I think we've done with linking all of these pylons up. Once you did the max easy streg on all four maps, I think we've got so far. We've got Transit, Die Rise, Mob of the Dead. Mob of the Dead does not count buried. So on, on all of these three zombies maps so far where we've had to link up the pylons, I think we've finished with that. We've got this full circuit. If you did all of the max easy stregs on all three zombies maps where you had to link up the pylons, um, you got this awesome ending in Buried. If you did the same with Richtofen on all of the three zombie maps, you got this awesome other ending for Richtofen in Buried. So in DLC 4, I don't think we'll be linking up any more pylons. We've done that. We've found out what's going to happen on the next map. And it's going to be really awkward, you know, because some people did the Maxis side, and that's where Maxis took over the earth. He's taken over the zombies. Uh, or some people did the Richtofen side. That's why Richtofen took over Samuel. So... DLC 4 is going to be so strange. No one definitely knows, you know, what's going to happen on the next Easter egg. Are the zombies' eyes going to go yellow for the people who did Maxis? Or are they going to um, stay as they are for the people who did Richtofen? But Samuel is still going to be taken over. So we're definitely not going to be linking up another pylon. But it's still going to be strange for people who did different Easter eggs. And I don't see how that's going to work. Now, moving on. Now, if you did the Maxis side... He did say that he's going to destroy the earth and everyone on it. So one possibility could be that he destroys the earth. And this is where the old crew returns. If you remember ages ago, we got a tweet from David Von der Haar, I think it was. Basically confirming that the old characters are coming back for zombies. So this could be happening. There could be two different ways. For the people who did the Maxis side... Um, they could get the old characters, they could be playing as the old characters within the next Zombies map. For the people who did the Richtofen map, they could still be playing as the new characters. Remember, Richtofen didn't destroy, say he was going to destroy the Earth, but he did take over Samuel. So, there could be two different options there. For the people who did the Maxis side, they could be playing as the new characters in the next Zombies map DLC 4. For the people who did, who did the Richtofen Easter egg, they could still be playing as the original crew. And for the people who didn't... Um, actually do the easter egg I don't know maybe they could just be playing with the old characters still it's really hard to think how they're going to work especially when these have they have these two different easter eggs but they've never had that on any other Call of Duty before so I think that'd be really cool for them to let you choose the characters, you know, that'd be awesome. If you like the old characters, um, you could do the Max Easy Strag on all Zombies maps. I know it's pretty hard, but I suppose that's what you have to do to get the old characters back. And if you do like these new characters and you don't want the old crew back, just do the Max Easy Strag or not do the Easter Egg at all. I think that could be really cool for them letting you choose. Because we've never really had an Easter egg like this from my experience where you have to, you have either two sides and both sides have a totally different ending. So what they're going to do on the next map, I don't know whether they'll, like I've said, give you the option to choose um, new characters or old characters. Or in the cutscene, they'll give you basically, you know, they're showing you what really happened. And what I think overall is they're going to make the old characters return in the next Zombies map from the start, you know. So they're going to give us this cutscene. Um, they're going to show us this Maxis Easter egg where Maxis destroys the Earth and then the old characters return from the moon, obviously, because they were on the moon, they were safe. They return from the moon um, back down to the Earth, maybe go down to the Aether, um, Aether where uh, Maxis or Richtofen is and they can take him down. Or they can show you the uh, Richtofen one where Richtofen takes over Samuel. Samuel kills all the old crew. You can no longer play as the old crew because Samuel killed them all um, because Richtofen made him because he's in his body and the old crew still have to return. So... Either way, I think the old crew are going to be returning. There are just loads of possibilities and what they could do with this. Tell me what you think about it down in the comment section below. Thanks for watching this video, guys. A lot of people have been asking me to do some more theories and some perk ideas, um, map ideas, some um, gun ideas on Black Ops 2 Zombies. So I'm going to start doing a load more of them again. Because um, I normally do a lot, but since we've had this new map pack, I haven't been doing as many. So I'm going to start doing quite a few more of them. So if you did enjoy, make sure you smack the like button in the face. If we could smash 150 likes, that would be amazing. Hit the subscribe button for more videos from me. And until next time, peace out.